Hi, it's Kev here from Australia Mobile Computer Repairs. Today I want to show you how you can convert your computer into a jukebox. Um, the only program that we need is a free one provided by Microsoft which is called Windows Media Player. Now if you don't have the icon on the desktop like I do, just click Start, All Programs, and then click Windows Media Player. Now you notice that Windows Media Player has got a heap of tabs at the top here. The one that we want is the RIP tab. Now I've already inserted my CD into the computer and it's downloaded all of the track titles and the artist name here. If for some reason your CD isn't available on the internet um, with the track names, you can manually type these in. Um, these little ticks here indicate these are the songs that we're going to copy to the computer. Now I've got a master option up here so if we take that off then we can just quickly select the tracks that we want. In this case we want the whole CD so we'll click on this button here. The only other option that we need to check as well just before we copy the CD to our computer is a little arrow right up here. If we click on that then go to more options. We just want to make sure that copy protect music is not on otherwise it uh, makes it a little bit harder if you ever want to copy it to your iPod or something like that and we also need to make sure that the quality is set up to best quality. If you do use um, an iPod or, or MP3 player or something like that, we can change it from Windows Media Audio to MP3. Personally, I prefer Windows Media Audio because um, the quality I find is a lot better than MP3. So once it's set on best quality, click Apply and OK. Just make sure that we've got all of the track selected that we want and click on Start Rip. Now you'll notice that in a second we'll have some progress bars just here and it'll let us know how much of that particular song that is copied to the computer. After a couple of minutes, maybe 10 or 15, the whole CD should be copied to the computer. OK, we've just fast forwarded 10 minutes and as you can see we've successfully ripped all of the tracks to our library. Um, yeah, once it's done, let's close down Windows Media Player. Now to have a look at the uh, music files that we've just uh, copied to our computer, we double click my documents, we'll click on my music and you'll have a list of all of the artists that you've copied. So in this case we've got Jack Johnson and it'll have his album here with his album art. Double click that and here are all of the songs that we've copied. So then we can use the task pane here and we can play them all. And that's it, you have now turned your computer into a jukebox. Hope you enjoy it.